What's up guys, I wanted to unbox this GLS holster from um, Safari Land. This is the, uh, I think this is the, the um, this is actually the 575 model from Safari Land. It has the GLS locking system. Um, I'm not sure you can see it there, but GLS. Um, bought this because I had a, um, I originally had a Bravo concealment holster from for my MMP 2.0 compact. And um, it did its job for the time being, but the problem is, um, well, it just didn't retain the, um, the gun as much as I wanted it to, even at the highest setting. So I had it screwed in all the way at the top and it still didn't have the best retention I wanted. It carried well, but um, I wanted to try something different. But um, if this holster doesn't do what I need to do, it'll get returned. We're gonna try it out anyway. So, um, let's see. Let's see, let's open this up. All right. This was, um, I got this off Amazon. It was about $45 before tax. Um, yeah, it's a lot more expensive on Safari Land's website, but um, if you find the model, there's only like two models that I know of. There's one for like the SIG P365 line. Um, and that's close to the same price. So, and I'm right-handed, so I have the right-handed model. Yep, and this is for the compact. This is for compact pistols. I'm not sure if you can see that, but there you go. Made in the USA, 575 IWB, inside the waistband, ProFit, compact, 3622. I think that's correct. Um, this is the manual. I'll read that later. Um, we have the extra, um, this thing is the J-hook that it comes with. So it comes with two different um, clips. This is the more traditional clip. You do, have, you do have to tighten this down. And it does come with the uh, tools. So well, actually, let me show you the clip first. Let's see. Let's see, there's the clip and the pieces. I don't want to lose anything to screw down there. Also, along with the tool for adjusting the tightness of retention, it comes with some wedges or pads to help push the gun closer to your body. And it goes in down here. You're supposed to, you know, put it in and twist it. And uh, the tool for adjusting is here. Uh, actually, it has some other stuff. I'm not exactly sure. I think it comes with a shim or something like that. But um, I'm not exactly sure how that works. But it does come with the tool in there. So you just dump it out. That, not exactly sure what this is. Not exactly sure, but I'll figure it out. Uh, oh, I think, um, I don't know. Yeah, I'm not sure, but these are the pads here. And there's the other one, the smallest one. So it can work as a four o'clock, four o'clock cutter. I'll try carrying it that, maybe appendix. Um, yeah, I don't think I don't think there's anything else there to really look at. Um, what else? Yeah, that's the I guess the rest of the manual. So we're gonna try to fit it in my crank gun. So my um, we'll try the MMP first. Um, we're gonna dump the magazine, clear it, got it clear, magazine. Ammo's out. We're gonna set that to the side. Okay. I'm just gonna see if it fits or how it fits in there. Okay. Seems to hold pretty well. Um I'm not sure how I like it. Um it control I mean it does cover the trigger guard mostly. Um kind of worried about that little opening there. You can tighten it some with the tool. Um, let's see, let's try the, oh, well, you gotta grip it, but there you go, it comes out like that. So I'll actually get my clock, 19X, see how that fits. Here it is, just gonna dump it, clear it, comes clear, pull the trigger. All right, let's see how it goes in here. 
Oh yeah, it has the light. That's my OLED. I know people hate the OLED, but I guess it was what I could get at the time. So I'll try it. Now I can try it because it's not fitted for a, a light system. But so it does click in there. We have to make adjustments to it to make sure, but it does go in there and it's not coming out unless I grip it. Then it comes out. So that's about it. Um, uh, thanks for watching the video. Um, see how the holster goes. Now, hopefully, I don't have to return it and get my money back. Hopefully, it's good, but we'll see. And um, thanks for coming, or thanks for watching. So, peace out.